Hello Lobos and Canvas learners. In this video I'm going to show you how to add buttons and banners to a home page. Alright, so I'm going to navigate over to Pages. I'm going to say View All Pages. And then I'm going to find the page that I want to make my home page, which in this case is the welcome one. And then I'm going to click on Edit. Right now this is a text only page and I want to add some buttons and banners and images to it. So I'm going to come up here and I'm going to select, I have two options really. I, if I've already imported content into my course, I can use course images. If I need to upload it for the first time, then I'm going to say upload image. So I'm going to say upload image, and that's going to let me search my computer. I'm going to find the banner that I want to use. And then I'm going to say submit, and it's going to pop that banner in. So again, I already had this banner saved. For information on how to make banners and how to download them and get them saved to your computer, please watch the video on how to create banners and buttons using Canva. Alright, so I am going to resize this. I have some default view options, but I'm going to make this custom. I want it to be 800 pixels wide. It is going to auto scale for me, and then I'm going to say done. All right, and there's my banner. So you just repeat those steps for any images that you'd like to add. If you're going to use buttons, we generally recommend that you use a table. And the reason for that is the table just helps keep it organized. Um, as far as your buttons going in and staying neat and organized on your page. So to add a table, you come right here and this is the table icon and then you pick the size that you want it to be. So I want it to be 4 by 2 and then there's my table. I can adjust the table properties. I don't want a visible border so I'm going to take that out and I want it to be center aligned. Okay and now I'm ready to start putting in some images. So I'm going to save this real quick because I want to put eight different images in, I want to go ahead and upload those to my course. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to go ahead and navigate over here to Files, and I'm going to say Upload. And then I'm going to come in here, and I'm going to go into the folder that I want and pick the buttons. Okay, so I want these eight buttons and I'm going to say open and that's actually going to go ahead and pop all eight of those buttons into my canvas course right now instead of having to add them one at a time. You can do it either way. You can add one button at a time by using the upload from computer or you can come in and add an entire folder worth of content by using the files upload option. So two different ways you can do that. Alright, I'm going to navigate back to pages now and this is my home page so I'm going to say edit and my table is still here and still visible. And I'm just going to go ahead and click into the table and then I'm going to hit the image icon just like I would if I was doing a page. But this time I'm going to say course images because again I've already uploaded these images to my course. And then I'm going to pick the one that I want and it's going to pop that image in for me. And then I just repeat these steps until I get all of the images populated into my table. And again, I can do upload, or in this case, I already uploaded them to my course, so I'm choosing course images. Now, you'll notice that right now they're, they're left aligned. I want them to be center aligned, so I'm just going to highlight that and then come up to the text editor in the top. And I'm going to change that to center, and it's going to center align them for me. All right, let's go ahead and save and see how this looks. All right, so there's my home page as it looks now. That's how you can add images and banners to a course homepage. Don't forget, to make this your homepage, you'll go to View All Pages, click on the triple dots next to the page you want, and say Set as Homepage. I've already got it there, so right now it says Remove. So if I removed it, I would say Use as Front Page. Then I'm going to go Home, and over here I'm going to say Choose Homepage. And instead of modules view, I'm going to say pages front page, save, and that is going to make my created home page or welcome page the home page that my students see when they come in. So when they click home, this is what they would see. 
The next video in this module will show you how to link these buttons to different modules or pages within your course. So stay tuned if you'd like to learn more.